Oh, it's Friday. It means time for Friday Follies, an impeachment edition. Joining us with all the details, Raymond Arroyo, Fox News contributor. All right, Raymond, you saw a moment at the trial last night that told a bigger story? It did. When, when the final questions came, Laura, for the House prosecutors, Jerry Nadler moved as fast as he's ever moved to answer, even when lead manager Adam Schiff tried to stop him. Any other comments the Senate would benefit from hearing before we adjourn for the evening? Jerry. Jerry. Mr. Chief Justice, members of the uh, Senate. <laughs> Jerry, Jerry, Jerry. It reminded me of another team that also kind of fell apart, had a big falling out, Laura. Hmm. No, that's all I ask. No, listen all right. to me. All right. No, is this fair? I'm only asking, yeah, see? No, I'm asking. I want to get to know. Is that hard? I just want to know. Raymond, both, Raymond, <laughs> Raymond, Raymond, both, Raymond. Both these Jerry's had enough of that shift, okay? Oh, what, yeah. what happened here? You'll remember, Nancy Pelosi is really to blame for this animosity between these men. Jerry Nadler, as head of the Judiciary Committee, he should have been the first prime mover oh, on no. impeachment. She put her friend and her accomplice Schiff to lead the not only the impeachment, but to guide the he hearing. He wanted to be shiftless. Well, and then you remember, when Nadler got up, he made those horrible comments to the senator saying, this is a torturous vote. Oh, yeah. Traitorous vote that set off alarms, oh, no. and then Nadler, the Nadler hustle may have been payback for this moment at a presser last week. Mr. Mr. Nadler, Mr. Nadler, the Republicans have been going. Uh, I'm going to the, respond to the questions. Okay, well, Mr. Nadler has uh, been yes. criticized by Republicans, Mr. Schiff. Are you? I'm going to respond to the questions, and Nadler had to just sit back and take it. Let me tell you, it didn't matter whether Schiff or Nadler led this thing. Or who was driving the bus, there wasn't enough gas to get it where they wanted it to go. It's over. But it shows you the tension and the animosity. In, I noticed there's something about Adam Schiff when he gets a little bit mm. uh, exercised Interiors. about something. No, his eyes get oh. really... He, he does that Marty Feldman the eye The eyes thing. distend a little you know, bit. Yeah, oh, we, we got to okay. move on, Since Lord. this impeachment uh, began, the media has taken up, well, the Democrat line. And they're trying to characterize the proceedings this way. Any other comments the Senate would benefit from hearing before we adjourn for the evening? Jerry, Jerry, Jerry. Mr. Chief Justice, Get members. That was I the wrong bite. wrong bite. It was actually, they were talking about this being a solemn, serious oh, solemn, occasion. Serious. Yeah, well, I'm yeah, not yeah. sure Senator Kamala Harris got the memo. Watch Chuck Schumer's reaction when Kamala was a little less than solemn and serious. Do you view it as at least a partial victory that you have a Republican like Lam Sorry. Uh, I'll start again. Yep. Do you view it as at least a partial victory? Start again when everybody's solemn. Oh, no, no. Yeah, let's well, let's cut that out from the report. So Kamala, I'm surprised Kamala didn't break into that. Remember how she did that dance tape? A little tape? song and dance Yeah, that routine, dance tape. The Bob Marley routine. Now, Laura, there was a moment that, frankly, it made me pretty sad when I watched this. The Senate chaplain, Barry Black, opened the Senate trial with this prayer. Listen closely. Remind our senators that they alone are accountable to you for their conduct. Lord, help them to remember that they can't ignore you and get away with it. For we always reap what we sow. Now, if you're going to condemn people and raise the, the judgment of God to them, don't do it over a partisan thing like this impeachment. Mm. This is divisive. He should be bringing people together. I'm sorry. I think the chaplain went above and well, beyond there were a his, of prayers. his authority. There were a number here. of prayers that were... You got it. You, got, you felt he like said, it was... He said earlier in the week, uh, the trial will make the nation stronger, wiser, and better. How? How? Raise your moral voice for things that matter. Abortion, religious liberty, yeah. that's where consciences is. All right, Raymond, be before we go, they say a picture is worth a thousand words. Yes, they do. Um, but... Is it really the case? Is Do we see the faces of what it all looks like at the end? Oh, so sad. This was after the, the Senate voted, Laura, no witnesses. Oh, oh. Very dejected. Hmm. She looks oh, happy. Claire Imagine McCaskill. having a drink with her tonight. Won't you oh. help this anchor? Oh, no. <laughs> this is like a save the children. You know, right? You know the old Thackeray line, Laura? The world is a looking glass and gives back to every man what his face shows. God help some of these folks. <laughs> I All hope right. they have happier days. When